In this video, I will share with you the best math apps for Android which I found extremely useful while studying maths. After that, I will share with you some other apps which I found really useful while studying. And after that, I will share with you some course apps which you can download to take different type of courses. And another thing I want to tell you is that this cursor is simply to show you where I am pointing. This is not my laptop. This is my phone. So let's get started. So firstly, let me share with you the apps which contain like math material to study. So the first one is this one that is pocket mathematics. This is like a pocket math book which contains the most important things in maths. For example, this is function, what are function, what they do, different type of formulas, etc, etc. So like a pocket mathematics book. Now, similar to this, there is also pocket physics, which contains important physics things really similar to this by the same developer. So you can download these both if you study math and physics like me. Now, the second app that I want to share and this app is like recommended by a lot of YouTubers. I have seen that. So this is brilliant. Now, this app contains different type of free and also paid courses on different type of things like this is exercise on logic, etc, etc. There are also daily puzzles and questions. Right now, I am in offline mode because I don't want to encounter ads. But this is a really good app to like study and increase your knowledge. So now the next and a really useful app. This app can increase the productivity of your phone like you use the phone, you will learn math. So this is the formula lock screen. This will convert your lock screen into a math tutor. It will show different type of formulas like random math formulas to you on your lock screen. Like whenever you will open your phone, you will see a math formula on your lock screen, which will help you to remember maths. For example, here are math formulas and like if you want to learn algebra formulas, switch this and it will show algebra formulas on your lock screen. So this is a really useful app and I really recommend you to download this one. And also this is a really new app and the developers are working to get physics and chemistry formulas too. So instead of storing information like these apps do, your phone can also help you solve math problems. So these are the apps which help me to solve my math problems. So the first app is MathWay. So this app is like having a math tutor at your hand. In this app, you just have to like type your math problem and send it. You can also take a photo of your math problem. Also, you can send your problem by voice. This app is really good at helping you solving math problems. A app similar to this one, you should also have a backup app. Like if this app doesn't work, you can also use this one that is photo math which is like specific to taking photos of your math problem and like giving solution of those problem. Right now I have switched off my camera so you don't see anything right here. But if you download this app in your phone, you will see like camera here. There you can take the picture of your math question and you will get the solution. But sometimes like these apps are like AI apps. They are not able to solve your math question because like sometimes you have to interact with humans. So now this app is really good. This app is not an app. This is originally a website named Reddit and it is a really famous website, but it is not that famous in India. So in this app, there are like different communities like communities of everything, everything, but they are communities like R get studying, R math, etc, etc. In those communities, you can post your questions and like people, really intelligent people will answer. Like there was a problem I was stuck on a transistor circuit problem and I was not able to find its solution in any other app. But I posted the question on Reddit and after 15 minutes, I got a response and the problem was solved. Also, there was another problem on like ratio test for convergence, Reddit solved that so you should have this app with which you can like interact with people ask them question like why this came why this came also this app has 
immensely broad communities about everything like if you want to solve circuits there is a r circuit etc etc so this app is really good i've used this one a lot also i share my math videos here too and people give a lot of response so now another app that is google lens in this app you have to select this text one and like take the photo select the text and this will search on google the biggest search engine in this world so like you will get some solution this app is really important and i used this one while i was preparing for a competitive exam this helped me a lot now these were the problem solving apps now how about exercising your brain so these two apps are really good for exercising your brain so this one is math riddles like this app has a lot of math puzzles game etc etc to play and this is a really good app to utilize your time and like to make your brain sharp now another app that is i use this one a lot this one is new this one this contains different types of games like this one like with which you can like play with someone else like test who's better at calculating maths now these were the games now i use one graphing tool and this helped me a lot while doing physics because in physics we deal with graphs a lot so desmos is the best app to plot graphs in this you can plot almost anything for example x is equal to y square so this is plotting this graph and like you can plot a lot of thing this gives a lot of different types of options so you should have this app if you are studying maths and physics i was finding a really good ebook reader on internet and i found this one this one is really cool normally i use the office that is this one the microsoft office for reading pdfs and documents but there was a old book which was like alex adventures to number land and that was not opening anywhere because it was a dot puv extension file so it was not opening anywhere but this app opened that book too this app is a really good like ebook reader supports a lot of different types of things so you should have this ebook reader if you are studying math and physics or like you study books on your phone then so we have done this pocket physics now i will share you some other apps which will like increase your productivity while studying so i was finding a timer app which will help me to implement like 45 to 15 minute principle so this is that app in which like you have a 45 minute timer and then you have a 15 minute timer then you have a 40 minute timer and it will like alarm and it will also count how many times you have studied the 45 minute thing you can also edit that in these settings like how much you want to work how much you want to break etc etc so this is a really good timer and it doesn't have that option to like block the notification for that i use like simple block thing in the phone so that i get no notifications while studying so now another app which will help you to use the greatest app in this universe that is your mind is this one that is stop breathe and meditate so now this app is really good for students because we know that great studying comes with great stress so now it asks you how are you then like you start and it also gives you time to think like how are you i will skip this right now it will ask you like how are you physically then how are you mentally and it will also ask you to add emotion like if you are sad add sad happy like if i add like happy in here and like find best activities it will search and give me the best activities to perform right now like five minutes gratitude etc etc and this app is really good for students who study a lot to like get their mind straight because sometimes a lot of assignments papers tests and the tension of the career etc etc is really bad so this app can help you with that so now let's go back another app that i want to share with you is this one that is this is sky view free app because this app is really good because i like watching stars at night and this app helps me to know which star is that this app uses the phone's gyroscope to see where this my phone is pointing and like give me the information of the star in front of me 
Also, this app is a really good example how math is really useful in our life because if we do not have math like these coordinates and the concept of galactic sphere, the developers would not be able to make this app. So this app shows us how math can help you to enjoy this world like I am sitting at night watching stars and like I can know what star is that one from those thousands of stars and that is because of math. So this is the beauty of math and this app is really good example of that. Now another app that is this one that is two players reactor this is a game and i want to share this game because this app will train your mind to think faster to like pay more attention this is a game that you will play with your friends and this will increase your reaction time attention and the skills that you need while solving math problems for example it contains a lot of games and like whenever you find a sad face you have to click and the first one who will click will get the point and i just want to tell you that this app is really harsh on your phone screen because when we like play this game what happens is that we forget that we are using our phone and we press really hard to like win and like this was a sad face so i clicked so i got the point or the player who is not like here didn't got the point so it contains a lot of games which will help you to increase your mental skills so this app is really good and also you can play it with your friends and enjoy a lot so the next thing that i want to share is first i will share these two then this one because this is just I want to share because this is not a useful app. So these are the two apps. I like uh, while working in labs, I have to measure a lot of things. These two apps help me do that. Like with these apps, you can measure things without like touching them. For example, this app, this one is measure. Firstly, this app is by Google, which is really good and it helps you to measure things. So let me show you a demonstration of this app. Now from this app we will measure this 30 centimeter scale. So now like you will point at the starting point of your measurement like this and like move your phone and this press right. So this is saying that this scale is of 30 centimeter which is right. So this is how you measure using this app measure for the object like if this scale is a little farther this app gives a little wrong results but this is a quite accurate app because this is by google so this was the video demonstration for measure and also this app is also similar to that but in this one you have to move your phone physically from one place to another to measure let me show you the demonstration of this app so now let's use this app that is moisture to measure that same scale in this app for example i will choose this object option so now like start measurement now now I will move my phone. Now I am like take it at rest. Now I will finish this measurement and it's saying like 30 centimeter. Oh my god, this is like really accurate. I didn't expect it to get 30 centimeter, but this is really cool. So this app is really good for measuring like your height, like put your phone down and like start measurement and put the phone at your head to get your height. So this is a really cool app too. So now the next app that I want to share is this one that is Windows Simulator. This app runs Windows 98 on your phone which is really cool and it gives you the experience of that. For example, see this here paint and you can like paint thing which is really cool to like run Windows on your phone. So now these were the other apps that I wanted to share. Now I will share you some course apps. These are the two really good course apps. This one is Udemy. So like in this time right now there is shutdown everywhere in this world due to this coronavirus. So you can install this app and take different type of courses. This app have like free courses and also paid courses too. Recently I was like uh, taking a ethical hacking course and it was definitely not to like look at people's webcams what they are doing in this quarantine moment definitely not 
I will really recommend this app. This app also have some free courses and also paid courses. The paid courses are better than free courses and that's obvious. So the next app is an academy. This is a really good app which provide free courses. So let me open this app. For example, I have selected like UPSC examination. In this app, you can like select different type of examinations from here like this and like you can prepare for those examinations i used this app to prepare for jam examination and for example like here this person is like live and like sharing some upsc related stuff and this is a really good app the creators of this app are like youtubers but they are highly qualified so this is a really good app to prepare for examinations so now another app that i want to share with you which is like a paid app but i just want to tell you about this this app is a really good math solver and it is like a ai computer that you have so i know most of us will not buy this app but you can use this full frame alpha from google there is a site of this where you can use this so if you don't find the solutions of the problem with any of these apps and don't want to post on reddit then you can use this one that is full frame alpha now also another thing that i want to tell you is this that i don't know how much of you know this that the phone's calculator is also a really good app yes and i just want to tell you that if you rotate your phone it opens the scientific calculator and with that you can increase the power of your phone's calculator uh, i'm just sharing this because i know there are a lot of people who have like really good phones from a long time never deleted their phone while opening a calculator and think that their calculator is really bad and there was a person definitely not me in the university who didn't know this okay so the phone's calculator is a really good app too so now with this this is the end of this video so please download and use these apps this is for what i made the video if you watched the video and never used any of the app never improved your life so this was a waste for me and for you too so please download these app use these apps to increase your math knowledge so if any of these app helped you this will mean a lot for me and if any of these app helped you please write in the comments like which app helped you the most and like other people will like it and people will know that which app to install from these so thanks for watching this video and always remember that math is everything